this country, I don't know. The northern governors coming together to say that they prohibit uh, spare parts trading in the north. Hey, hey, Gideck. Hey, God. May the grace of the Lord be upon you all. <laughs> Why? Wait, let me ask you a question, okay, before we go into this. <laughs> this country now. Wait. Are you a Nigerian or are you a Biafra? The other time, the young people came out, they ah. protested. Are you I, I was happy. I could not go out. Uh, you can't do that because you might get shot. If you are a Nigerian, show by lift of hand. You know one thing about this country? Uh, they, they are bent on making you poor, either by hook or by policy. The only thing that can guarantee our freedom is the independence of Biafra. If you are a Biafra, show by lift of hand. There's no two ways about it. Okay, listen, listen, let's get straight into this now because I'm about to say some things that are either going to make you angry, make you happy, or just make you laugh. Either ways, I'm just a content creator. Hey, okay, welcome to my YouTube channel. My mom, when, when I wake up like this, I just woke up. Don't mind that I'm wearing caps in my head. I never even brush my mouth today. I just woke up so make I just feel this my pillow. Talk about this. Now, Nigerians have reacted to something that is really really very very controversial to hear from the attorney general maybe the northern governors coming together to say that they prohibit uh spare parts trading in the north okay no, no see this is someone that has that is in the highest position of law and he's opening his vocal cavity to say this does it hold water for a northern governor to come we must learn a lesson and state expressly that he now prohibits Spare parts trading in the north. Oh, Mumu, not too much. Because all of us, what we are good at is talking, talking, <laughs> talking. But we are talking about restructuring of Nigeria, which is a very good idea. But then what structure are you talking about? That may not be as old enough for you to even listen to. This man is saying that he's equating open grazing ban and Igbo people on their spare parts. You know why this thing touches me so much is that my father started as a spare part. Seller. So when the southern governors are asking for restructuring, you're throwing back to them mm. that they need to go and restructure their Is that what you're saying? It's truly. May the grace of the Lord be upon you all. <laughs> My father started his life as an in industrious Igbo man selling spare parts. My head was spare parts. When I'm a spare part, most of you know when your cash pause, where you go to go and buy spare parts. He has settled not less than four to five people, I think from my base of knowledge, that I've gone to start their own life in the same business. How we people do, we help ourselves. You know how our entrepreneurial mindset and skills and how we get to, you know, build this empire we have as Igbo people that are very industrial. It is indeed a dangerous position. Nigeria president now for two. For any governor in Nigeria to think that he can bring about any compromise. Your president is now a picture. Any compromise on the freedom and liberty of individuals to move around. The only thing, the only thing, the only thing that can guarantee our freedom is independence of Biafra. So that's why I keep saying, if Nigeria is going to stand again, they can freeze their account. Uh, Every but I know the uh, painful thing. You know Nigeria was number two. Mm -hmm. In cryptocurrency. In cryptocurrency. No, in, yeah, yeah. Yeah, no one in the mm -hmm. world. The whole world, number two, and they did this thing. This country. May the grace of the Lord be upon you all. Let it come down to the south. Now, can you imagine put this thing in If you look at this, the way this thing is going, all of us we can be here on YouTube talking. Oh yeah, yeah, you comment here, comment here, comment here. Like I'll be showing you the reactions of Nigerians to also this particular statement made by someone that has held the high in fact the highest position you know what it means to be the attorney general of the federation this country now you know what it means even given senior advocate of nigeria i'm a more position senior advocate of the the the, the <laughs> I, I don't understand so you will not advise the president to listen to those calls for restructuring the earlier every one of you realizes the better it will be for us they should address it at their own level first and then let us see what happened before now coming over to the president. It's not about the president. You be mumu. You think so they wise. You are a mumu man. For you to equate grazing, open bank grazing, to those that are selling spare parts in the north, our people. 
this, you know, is now taking us back to what happened before when they were saying, okay, these people go back to your side, these people go back to your side. When all of these things started, it, it, they, they wanted to make it look like it was a tribal thing that was happening. Now we are getting to see that there's an agenda somewhere, somehow. And look at those sitting at the top affairs of the nation. So tomorrow, if they're even going to sit down and talk about this whole restructuring thing, who are the ones that are going to be clamoring for it that are there in position? That's why he can confidently say that. Maybe the northern governors coming together to say that they prohibit uh, spare parts trading in the north. It's, wait, it's a cow in Nigeria. <laughs> so, 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 but it has it gotten to a point where by cows are now equated to living beings. Last time I saw a video of a cow inside hospital. Though. I don't know what this cow is looking for in the hospital. What is going on in Nigeria? How if you matter how sometimes? If if I were to reincarnate and come back to this country, I'd rather come as a cow. I think I'd feel a lot safer that way. You know. Because they have people to defend them. Because I will share people because when I react like this, people would think that hey, this boy is crazy. You see how did this boy my boy. What have Nigerians how have they reacted to this particular statement? If, come on, look at even if even the leader of the army saying that uh, uh, if, if, if Boko Haram person repented, he can even become president of Nigeria. An ex Boko Haram stands having laid his arms and comes back, turns his way away from the, his negativity. He stands to be a president of this country. He stands to aspire to any position in this country. President. So where, where is the point? Where, 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 when do we now start talking about someone's track record? It's not when you are coming for a position. We look at Abida one now that everybody, nobody is talking about it now. Someone that vehemently came out and spoke against uh, 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 propagating for, 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 for the agenda of Boko Haram and talking about Christians so being fidel if you are not Muslim, blah, blah, blah. Now, what position is he holding in government? This country now. Now, this is what Augustine Oguihi Agene. I think I have to take a screenshot of this because some of you need to see it on the screen. Now, take a close look at the screen. Look at what this person said. He said, the northern governors coming to impose Sharia law and banning the sale of alcohol and even confiscating their beer does not hold water be. Because over there, you cannot be drinking alcohol. But when, when Nigerian breweries eh, that has been paying taxes for operating in Nigeria, when they see the revenue, the revenue goes to them. Oh, oh, are you seeing it now? Let's let's go. Let's go. Some people are some people are making some valid comments. That's why I think it's really worth for me to just share because these are the I'm now becoming the voice of the voiceless. Now I am um, Acha. Let me look. Let me take a screenshot of that so you get to see it right here on your screen. Um, Acha Abraham says, "What kind of analogy is this? Spare parts trading and open grazing. How is spare part trading constituting danger to other businesses? Think about it. An Igbo man with freedom of movement." carry himself, Jejo, go to come to maybe the north, rent a shop, oh, pay his normal rent, oh, get his, his, his rights to practice. Oh. How does that infringe on anyone's right? You don't come and take someone's shop by force. You don't, you don't, uh, 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 oh, come on, think about it. I, I don't know if, you, if what I'm saying is making sense. But now, and uh, somebody, a book you, uh, a book you or Fulani that will carry cow, will infringe and destroy people's land on, along the way. Even come on your land and eat your crop so your plants don't have the freedom to breathe air listen in this world if we if we if 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 we cut down all the trees in the world because some of you if you cut down all the trees in the world no plants all of us will die have you not heard you do need to rent but that's not photosynthesis uh -huh. carbon uh, uh, water um in case we have plant to exhibit I'm not using all these things again. I mean, if you can't come back, say the people that, but master is one self, don't worry. Although, yeah, they, you know what is putting food in my mouth today, but uh, you yeah, are yeah, getting what I'm saying because it does not make sense. How can you even, how can you even equate that freedom of movement of beings? Now, okay, before we're saying, okay, let them give them land, but. Wait, 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 wait. For you, if 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 you people are looking for, and this they're not even agreeing to having ranches, oh, which is something that is currently being practiced now. Go to America and tell me whether somebody would take carry cow from Houston and go to Texas if we are copying them then. <laughs> you own ranches. You don't even need to carry these cows. And maybe the time you only have to bring them to this other side is 
when you have to sell them now we are saying okay maybe they want because all of this thing is just for them to cut cost so instead of them having a ranch where they have to be you know you know really taking care of them and then growing plants and all of that for them let, let us just go and chop free food because what they come to decide to do is just to chop free food but even while you are doing that you are now killing naming and claiming authority who are now the slaves or more about slaves but i will come to your land legally but own a own a shop pay rent to someone that owns it in your that's the one thing i like about Ibo people about nigeria we have that hustling spirit but that is what i'm doing because one the money the money but the money it does not make sense I just woke up with this sense. Look at someone other other person's reaction here. It's, um, it it wouldn't like. Let me take a screenshot of it. Mark. You're not fun at this internet. That you book on me with sometimes. Us not. These channel guys will sit and let this man talk meaningless stuff and not push and no pushback from them. Oh yeah, the men on the channel. Uh, uh, as some news news channels they just want to uh, all of them that are creating content they don't really attach personal sentiments to it which i think is still okay because if you don't attach personal sentiments to things you become more logical and straightforward the people selling motor parts don't carry guys and they pay taxes period we pay taxes oh them that okay now don't you know they're supposed to be paying those people that, that they're supposed to be even be paying tax to the government that are coming to chop their plants from their land because when they are now selling the when they are selling the cows to us, how do they do that? And I want tax and this number and area sometimes and I put tax. Nigeria, no, like this. Sometimes I go beat all this. I just say. Government day here, make I beat them come off on my phone. <laughs> anyway, that is it today on one day one story. And this is my wake up video. Anytime when you see me for here, you don't see me for my studio. <laughs> no, say I just wake up, do video because on a time for that time and my time for here not be the same. So I just wake up from one, I go look for and see what thing they have to say. Ah God, make I just do video talk to now. Because me, remember, I think on video. In case you have not met me before, I found Bochi Joke. Being real George number one. I had that up. What? I'm gonna my other channel with George Vlog. So if you want to know about where I'm living my life, um we hena gaga say um um we hala say you go to my other channel, you see it in the description. <laughs> George Vlogs. <laughs> But you can click here to watch other videos that I have made before. <laughs> and we can many videos. You know, you know, you can do no in a little dick in any film. Because I take my time to make video. Anyway, see you guys ah, next time. No, 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 bye bye.